Hi guys, Knights here. How's everyone doing? Welcome to my channel. This is gonna be short guide. Uh, this is more like reaction to the guide made by Grand Foboar. And he basically made the guide how to install ACT. If you don't know what's ACT, ACT is DPS meter for, or DPS overlay for Final Fantasy 14 and all the other games. The problem is that uh, Grand Foboar, first of all, thank you very much for this guide. It was very helpful but um, probably you are a very, very experienced PC user and you take some uh, steps in, the, in this guide for granted and you did not explain them for uh, normal users who don't take those things for granted. So I will explain them and I will add it and I will comment under your video. I, will, I hope you will pin it. So uh, basically what he did, he installed 32 uh, bit version and uh, as you guys know in the year 2018 uh, many people are using 64-bit uh, uh, processors so basically uh, you will have to install 64-bit version if you want to run it properly all right so first of all uh, uh, watch his guide until this point when he is installing the game okay now when he installed the game close uh, stop it uh, the link will be in the description of this guide and he advises you to go to the download, uh, click on the download link. Okay, when you click on the download link, you want to you want to uh, download this setup, okay? So we downloaded it and we stopped. Now, when we want to install 64-bit version, you have to click on the versions and you have to go here, Act 64-bit. And you have to download this one, okay? So click on the download. I already got it downloaded many times. Now, uh, now we we have already installed the base game because we stopped his guide. So go and find the installation. Uh, I'm going to open it like this for you. Okay. So as you will have only few folders here because I already have uh, this update installed. So just drag and drop the, uh, the the new update inside. I'm not gonna do that and install it. It is very possible that um, the installation will give you error on the end of the installation. Just click it, doesn't matter, all right? Uh, one of those uh, files won't work, so just run this shortcut. Okay, I have my checklist here, so download, uh, place the installation, okay. Auto wizard plugin. So I'm gonna run it for you. Always, when you run it, run it as an administrator. It's very, very important, guys. So I'm going to run for you the startup wizard. So this is what you see when you first time open the, uh, the ICT. You go in next, parsing plugin, get available plugins. This is what you see in his guide, uh, but I have to do it. All right, so use this plugin, Final Fantasy 14, use this plugin, plugin added started. And now this is very important. Um, he forgot to mention this. So. Uh, uh, use for reference no okay and now I'm going all the way back to my PC local disk C uh, users your name and now you have to go to app data but unfortunately 99% uh, of the of the PC users don't have uh, hidden files shown so you won't see app data here so what you have to do you have to go to the control panel then file explorer options and now view and show hidden files, folders, and drives. Apply, okay, all right? Now, you will clearly see that app data is already, already there. Go to app data, go to roaming, advanced combat tracker, uh, logs, and this will be your log, but if you don't see it, switch it here to any file. Sometimes the game, uh, the Windows messes up and uh, you don't see it under game log files, so just click any files and this will be network and some numbers. Okay, put it here, next, and that's it, close. Uh, he advised you in the guide to close it and to restart it. So we're going to do that. We're going to do that. Run as administrator always. Now, next step. Uh, show all hidden files. Okay, go check the connection. So 
Uh, when you go to plugins, you have to check if your plugin of Final Fantasy XIV is working properly. So click on this plugin. If you don't see any error here, everything works perfectly, like here. Okay. Now this step is very, very important. Click on Final Fantasy XIV setting. Now I don't have my game running because I don't know why. Now you have to click on test game connection. When I click on test game connection, it says failed because game is not running for me but for you it will say um, successfully connected to the game or error if there's if there's error you have to do two things okay first of all first of them is you have always always run the ACT as administrator always very important second thing is you have to add it to the firewall so click on firewall defender windows firewall defender then allow up or feature through windows defender firewall then change the thing and probably you will not have advanced combat tracker here you will not so allow another app browse and find it okay find this shortcut this shortcut and uh, add okay and add after you add check both squares and and click ok and click ok all right that's it after this, restart, restart the ACT and text the game connection. Don't forget you have your fantasy have running and everything will be all right. Just hit some dummies or hit some enemies and you will see your your data uh, here. Thank you very much guys for run, uh, for watching. From now you can uh, run uh, Grand Foboa guide again uh, and uh, check how he's setting up everything and so and so and so. Thank you guys very much for watching thank you grateful back for this guide it helped me very much and uh, don't forget to like share comment and subscribe it's very important for small channels like mine and he's now i see that he says only 30 subscribers so i gave him a subscribe so don't forget to subscribe to him and as always have a good one bye bye Truth will break your chains, sweet.